Hello, my name is Angela Broughton from polesandblinds.com. I'm going to show you how to make eyelet curtains using an eyelet tape. Uh, personally, I prefer to use the ordinary rings that you cut the holes yourself, but I'll show you that in a separate video. So here we are now with the curtains and the sides hemmed, the corners done, mitered corners done, and the finished curtain length measured. Uh, and it's time to attach the tape. The, the eyelet tape that you buy has these little toggles on the back, which once you've fitted the tape to the curtains, you click it together and it holds it holds the folds of the eyelet curtain in place so the thing to do is to find the center point on the curtain find the center point on the tape mark them both with a ring and roughly position that there then we mark where's my tape measure you mark from the centre of the last ring, two and a half to three inches from the centre of the ring to the edge of the curtain. And you always, always must have an even number of eyelets, otherwise you'll be starting off with the first one with the leading edge of the curtain going back to the wall, going across, and if you don't have an even number, the last, the last Fold, so to speak, will be coming sticking straight out into the room as opposed to folding back against the wall again. So take this and pin top and bottom the tape. Except we've just got to mitre the corner in and turn the tape. So here we are now with the eyelet curtain tape pinned top and bottom into the curtain heading, and now I'll machine it in. Right, machine a couple of stitches then. Going steady over the pins. There's the mitre. So straight round the corner. And machine across. Obviously, the other end and along the bottom. So there's the hole cut. Take the right side of the ring, put it on the on the curtain, and push. And there's the eyelets already. Turn it over, and there's the little toggles to do up that hold the curtains in the folds. The um, little plastic toggles do them up in the middle and then they will hold them, the pleats firmly in place on the pole. Always make sure that the first and last ring has the curtains going to the back towards the wall. And there's a pair of eyelet curtains with using eyelet curtain tape. 